welcome to day three of the Main Bank Malaysian Open 2014. I'm Malayne Daly. We've enjoyed the videos we've put up for you the past two days. I'm here at the Pavilion. Now, the Pavilion's where the prize giving ceremony is going to be held for the Pro Am, which is happening today. Let's take a look at what went down at the welcome dinner last night. And we are here at the Main Bank Malaysian Open welcome party. I have scrubbed up a little bit nicely. Now before the program begins tomorrow and before the actual competition actually begins on Thursday, it is a time for the players, the corporate sponsors, you know, socialites in Malaysia to meet up, mingle, get to know each other a little bit better and just to let their hair down just a little before crunch time begins. So I can't wait to see who's here. Why don't you come with me and go check it out. And there you have it, that's what happened last night. Really, really great fun, I must say. And as I mentioned earlier, the Pro-Am began today. There was the first set of the tournament this morning where the pros played with um, corporate sponsors, with clients, basically avid golfers in the Malaysian golfing scene. Now they're just relaxing in the pavilion, having their lunch, and then the second set will happen this afternoon. I'm a little bit hungry, so I'm gonna go grab some grub now. I am here with a legend caddy <laughs> dude, Billy Foster, who has been a caddy for, I just, was just, he just told me, 32 years. How, did, how on earth did you get into it, Billy? Well, it was just a, a tournament at my home golf club. Uh, in in eight, England? Yeah, 1982, 1981. And uh, I just caddied with a few juniors. I was 16 years old and working for my father as a carpenter. Okay. Uh, and a friend of mine decided we should go to Spain on a six weeks holiday and try and carry out a few tournaments down there. And we did, we enjoyed it, and, and one guy liked me and asked me to come back and carry full time, so I did. Uh, there wasn't much money in the game then, but uh, I carried for six or seven years. And I was about to turn assistant professional myself, and Seve Ballesteros asked me to work for him, so Fantastic. I couldn't turn it down, and I'm still on the magic roundabout. And um, what is it about caddying that, that you absolutely love? Um, the, the camaraderie with the other caddies, you know, it's like a, having a third family. You know, you've got your family at home, but you certainly have a family on tour with all the caddies and, and some players, you know, and uh, the sense of humour and the fun of, of travelling around has always, always appealed to me and it's, it's, it's great fun being on the, on the tour. Did you ever have a dream um, of becoming a pro one day or actually, you know, being in a tournament? No. no? Is there a reason why? <laughs> I'm not good enough. I was a decent player, but like a three handicap is, is like a 18 handicap compared to, right. to the top players. So it was, it was never an option. Fantastic. And I've, I understand that you've been uh, with uh, Lee West for the past four years. What's it like caddying for him? It's great fun, you know, it's, it's like caddying for your best friend, you know, it's, wow. uh, we have the same sense of humour and we're on the same wavelength, so it's, uh, it's great fun on the golf course and you need to have fun and, and get along with your boss, mm -hmm. as well as trying to give the right numbers out there, so it's a cool. good team. Okay, and what's your take on um, this year's tournament, um, being in Malaysia again, this is your sixth, seventh time yeah, here? I've been here quite a few years, yeah. Mm -hmm. it's, uh, so, it's about fun. this particular year, what, um, what's your prediction? Well, Lee's starting to play really nicely, you know, he's, he's, he's not played his best for a few months, but um, he's just turned the corner the last couple of weeks and uh, I would expect him to feature come Sunday, all being well. Okay, and w one more question, what's your favourite part about being in Malaysia? Um, there's lots of things I love about Malaysia, I love, I love Asia in general, but mm -hmm. uh, you know, it's, the food's great, the, the weather's... Do you like the spicy food? Yeah, and the weather's much nicer than England, so... Not too hot? Not too hot, well. not too bad. Fantastic. Well, thank you so much and have a great uh, week ahead. Thank you. Thank you. Another event which is on the agenda this afternoon is the Junior Clinic. Now, in 2012, Maybank actually set up an academy to nurture young talents who are going to be maybe one day um, super pro golfers of the world. So this afternoon, a lot of um, the kids are coming together to learn from the professionals. So why don't we go and check them out? Quite interesting. How long have you been playing golf for? 
Dah berapa lama main golf? Empat tahun! Sejak satu tahun you main golf? Yes. I hear you're very, very good. Do you practice every day? Ya? Yeah? With whom? Dengan siapa? Oh, okay, okay. Dengan Dada. Okay. I'm Marli Sahanis. I'm 15 and I've been playing golf for almost one year. Okay, and you? Hello, my name is Amira. I'm 15 years old too and I've been playing golf for two years and a half. Cool. And the thought among the roses? <laughs> I'm Daniel. I'm 15 and I've been playing around six years. Six years. Okay, so what is it about golf that excites you and are, are you are you part of the Maybank Academy um, Junior Clinic as well or are you just here just to learn from the pros? I think you're just learning from the pros. Okay, well, and who do you who are you so excited to meet this particular Maybank Malaysian Open? Me, Matthew Nasiru. Kenapa? Because he's a good player. Is he? Yes. Okay, cool. And what about you, Mira? Uh, have you, you know, are you are you excited about this tournament? And you know, are you looking forward to meeting anyone in particular? Yeah, uh, me too. I'm I'm interested in like meeting Matteo Manasero. Everyone wants to yeah. meet Matteo. <laughs> What's so special about because him? Because he's young and energetic, so he's quite cute, right? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Some sort of. Um, have you got any intentions of uh, maybe becoming pro one day? Is that something that you're interested in? Uh, but, but now I'm just going to like minor tournaments or some sort of it. Okay. Uh, why did you? How did you start getting into playing golf? Uh, it actually came from my father. My father like uh, introduced me to golf, and suddenly I had this interest. Okay. So, so how good are you now? <laughs> Not as good as they are. Really? Do you do you guys have a handicap? Uh, no. No. Below uh, lagi. What's your handicap? So modest, just 26. Yeah, anyway, have fun. Um, it's going to be a great afternoon, right? Thank, Thank you. you. Okay, Bye. waste camera.